Hello everybody, I'm Robert Longabeam, and I'm at my high school here in Alexandria, Virginia. Here with my beautiful mother, <laughs> the woman who makes it all happen. And then my rider, my sister, she's don't miss games. She's always there. My best friends right here, yes, Mike. Sir. This is my receiver. Mm. He was actually threw him a few touchdowns. He was my guy. Yeah. And I was playing quarterback too. I was giving him some bump, yeah. you know. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> if it's competition, he'll get to it. That's what he likes. He likes competition. That's, that's just it. He's a com he's just a competitor. He's an athlete. So my mom, she used to run track. She held some records at Deerfield for a while. So I'll probably say the speed side definitely comes from her. He's actually very nice. He can, can be a little mean when needed, but um, he's actually a very good brother. He's the youngest of five children, five and heartbeats. I call them my five heartbeats, a little play off the R&B group, the five heartbeats. One sister lives in Florida. Rob, we love you so much. We are so proud of everything you've accomplished thus far, and we know you're gonna kill it this season. His other sister lives in Oklahoma. I can't wait to see you ball out this season and see all the great things that you're gonna do. I love you so, so much, and I'm so proud of you. Mwah. His older brother is a school teacher and a high school football coach um, with his dad, so they're at a football camp. I love you, keep doing what you're doing, and remember, I was always the one who told you he was gonna be the one. Coach Dowdy, he was my everything coach. He was confident and competitive. He was a hard worker, consistent, and high IQ guy. Anytime he touched the ball, you knew he could score. So we were down a touchdown, and we could be at you know, the five yard line, and it could be three seconds left. It's like, as long as Rob's on the field, we got opportunity to score here. Man, the youngest, you know, in the football family. It makes it more fun to coach because he understands exactly what you're saying. He was he was the coach on the field. Um, several times he would change coverages on his own. Um, <laughs> and you know, but again, you got a player that understands down and distant situations. You let it go, especially if he's right. Since I've got here, like these have been the people who've been here with me and like helped me get to where I am now. And I wouldn't be here without any of them. So like, it's big for them to still be here and knowing I still have their support and everything I do. Describe dad. <laughs> <laughs> Who can you con easiest? Who is street smart? Who's a better driver? Who's funnier? Who is more laid back? Who spends the most money? My name is Jimmy Longbeam, Robert's dad. We're super, super proud of you. We know the best is yet to come. Go Ruckers. He's been a coach for a long time, so like, we could win by 30. But when I get in that house with him, he gonna get on me about that one mistake I had. Taking me off the field a couple times, just to make an example out of me. I did nothing wrong. <laughs> did nothing wrong. <laughs> We're here at Fairlington Pizza Shop, where we get good pizza and some great wings and fries. So let's go on in. This is Nick, the owner. Hey, how you doing? This is what the is, spot. It's the oldest pizzeria in Alexandria. He always took this up, like, because we were football players, and he knew my dad, and he played at TC, so it was always, like, great stuff. He got TC everywhere around here. The, these hot wings with some fries, maybe a couple slices of pizza. So it's some great, great meal. We are in Cameron Station in Alexandria, Virginia. Um, where we lived all of Robert's high school career. We lived on those top two floors. Yeah, I, I lived on the top floor. It was my room up there. We're so close, like, I usually talk, talk to her once a day, like, for, we just sit on the phone and just have each other's company sometimes. So it's like, actually being home with her and stuff, it's always a good feeling to get her home, being able to get home and being around her. I be missing her all the time. Like, she's my rock for real, she's helped held me down, like helped me get through college and stuff. So she's been a big part of my life. So whenever I get a chance to come home and be around her, it's always fun. Mm -hmm. 